Hey, what's up everybody, Rich Gaming Guy here. Today in this video, I'm gonna answer a question I've been getting a whole lot here on the channel over the last couple of months. Can you use two Sindin light guns at the exact same time? So we're gonna jump into Botocera version 35 and test this out. Let's dive into it. All right guys, so I just booted up Botocera. This is my light gun specific build. So every single game on here is a light gun game. We're gonna check out House of the Dead too. I just plugged in both Sindin light guns and so far so good. If we look on screen here, I'm gonna aim up there at the top of the arcade here. You can see both of these are tracking perfectly on screen. So we're gonna launch House of the Dead 2. This is within Sega Dreamcast. Um, we're gonna see if it works here. I have not checked this out yet. So I'm checking this out with you guys right as I'm filming this. So we're gonna see if this works. Um, and how well it works if it does. Seems to be good, at least in the menu there. All right, here we go. And it looks like we're good. Yeah, there's... Oh, I'm a little too close. Yeah, we're good. Everything's working great here. I'm just not good at two players when I am both players. All right, so everything is great in here for Dreamcast. I'm gonna back out of Dreamcast though. I wanna check out some classic arcade. I just wanna make sure that this works, you know, across the board and it's not just working with that specific collection. So let's go in here. Um, let's check out Area 51. This is a great two player um, light gun arcade game really familiar with it so I'll know right off the bat if everything's performing correctly or not so let's add our coins unfortunately that border at the bottom is blocking how many credits we've added but we got two players in there let's see if they're tracking on screen all good so far let's hope that it works in the game now they keep inching too close always make sure that you're like six feet away from your TV I'm within that so um, yeah we're good here So I'm kind of aiming together just because I'm not that well organized with two players. And now if you notice the um, blue one, which is this gun right here, is kind of going in and out. That's not an issue with the controller. That's an issue with I have too many lights here while I'm trying to film. So um, it interrupts the... Um, it interrupts the signal because I have so many lights behind the camera right now. So when I kind of pull myself away from where the lights are, it's consistent. So yeah, everything works great on here. Two Sindin light guns, two players in all of these games. Couldn't be happier with the experience. It's spot on. I'm a little awkward with it because I've never played as both players before, but holding my own, I suppose. If I aim close together, I seem to do much better. It's definitely chaotic though. All right, guys, you can see firsthand exactly how well this actually works. Now, the only downside is I'm alone today. So I was playing as both players. I'm not super good at doing that. I've never done that before, in fact. So in the end, I definitely got killed in those games pretty quickly, but the performance is great on both Sindin and Light Guns at the same time as player one and two. So I can say with 100% confidence that two Sindin and Light Guns certainly work together in each of these games. Now, I only did two games for this video just because I wanted to try to keep this short and sweet, but I have checked out a bunch of different collections on Botocera 35 and everything worked perfectly. Everything that worked with one player worked with two at the same time. So that's gonna do it for this video today. If you guys found this video helpful and you enjoyed the content, please leave me a thumbs up on the video. It's a huge help to me here on YouTube. And of course, if you haven't hit subscribe yet, please hit subscribe on this video and stay up to date on all future videos here on the Retro Gaming Guy YouTube channel. Thanks for your support. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next video.